Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. So let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Sag with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's start with love. Let's see what's going on uh, in love for the Sagittarius. Let's see. Right, okay, so we've got Ice Queen and Soulmate. So somebody, this could be you, Sag, my uh, feminine uh, Sagittarius. You have gone through a lot, okay, maybe with your soulmate. Or maybe on this journey to finding your soulmate. Therefore, you could be coming off as the ice queen. Um, maybe jaded, uh, scorned, a little cold. You might need to warm up. Some of you could also just be mad at your soulmate. Mad at the person that you know you're supposed to be with. Uh, maybe because they are not showing up. You know, in the capacity that you feel like they should be showing up in. Uh, maybe they haven't done what, you know, what they should be doing. Let's see past love so uh this could be energy of the past here also this could be energy of um maybe your soulmate you you and your soulmate are not together there has been a breakup you're thinking about the past here you're thinking about how cold they were with you or to you or vice versa this is how you were with them someone it was just not warm not inviting not welcoming still needing to get over maybe some past hurt Let's see what's going on here. Gossip. Somebody, you know, is feeling jaded or hurt or um, a level of scorn because somebody did too much talking and not enough action. There was a lot of gossip. You know, somebody would say one thing, their actions would not follow. There was also other people, you know, in the business, in their business. Somebody is keeping you away from actually going towards the person you're supposed to be with. And it could be somebody from your past. You want to go backwards, but there's somebody in your present who's holding you up. Wow. As I say, that young female. So, Sag, there could be someone who is 25, younger, or they don't have to be that age. They could just act young, look young. They're not serious about maybe connections, about life in general. Maybe they're just out to have fun. They're into fashion, beauty, themselves. This could be you, Sagittarius, the dark male. You're the man in the, in the midst of all of this. Or you're the female, and this is the man here. There's something that this male is keeping to himself. He's trying to keep something a secret, not letting on. Not letting on to, on to how he feels, what he wants. Children. It could have something to do with children. Obstacles. Somebody feels like um, maybe a child is in the way, is a problem. Or children. Somebody has uh, is having problems with their children and then there's also um some somebody can't get pregnant or can't maintain a pregnancy it's a lot of work for somebody to become pregnant or maintain it yeah family There's somebody also wanting their family back, but there's some obstacles in the way that maybe the universe put here because somebody needs to do the work on themselves in order to have this family. There's also somebody not able to conceive because they need to do some work on themselves. The universe is not blessing them with that family dynamic. Someone is sticking around or staying around just for the money. Let's see what the future energy is for Sagittarius. I heard somebody knows they're being used and they just don't even care. What is the future energy? Somebody is sticking around for the children also. Somebody now wants a family. They didn't at first. 
future energy for Sag. Future energy for Sag. Okay, message. So you may be getting a message or you may be giving a message within the next seven days. It's good news. It's uh, welcomed news. It could be from somebody or this could be you, Sag. It could be from someone who's concerned, who's maybe fallen into a depressive state. Something happened here to the point where it's hard to maintain emotional and mental stability because someone hasn't gotten over the issue or the issues. It's just been kind of swept under the rug. Let's talk about career and finance. All right, let's see what's coming for career and finance. What's coming for a career and finance? Okay. All right. So we can cards. All right. So the Tower, Strength card, the Page of Pentacles, and the Four of Swords. In the midst of something falling apart, in the midst of the rubble. Be strong, maintain, hold it together because there is good news about maybe money matters, financial matters coming into you because of some level of consistency, diligence that you took in order to see this thing through. And then you'll be able to rest and make plans for the future. This money coming in is make it or break it time. This good news coming in is make it or break it time. And it's about planning and storing up for the future. Yeah, you're going to have a complete shift in energy. In the wheel of fortune, it's now going to be turning in your favor. Destiny, fate, some fated or destined opportunity. You may know that this come, is coming in for you. Your psychic abilities could be heightening now or someone around you, their psychic abilities are heightening. There could be a soulmate energy coming in, but this is career and finance now. It says do not give up before the miracle actually happens. This is your energy, the nine of wands. I know you're tired. There has been an up, everyday uphill battle, everyday struggle in terms of your finances. You may have had to pay out a large sum of money that kept you stuck in a place of always recreating or refunding. But it says have, have a shift in perspective and also in personality when it comes to experience, life experience. Look at the past. Therefore, it can be, you know, um, knowledge of how you need to operate in the present and in the future change how you look at things and what you're doing go within it says that you're looking for answers outside of you but you already know what the answer is it says you will have triumph victory success because you uh you're doing the right thing. You've put a lot of energy into a creative endeavor. This looks good. Just keep at it. Do know that you're in a place of maybe being in the in-between here. Uh, things will turn over and turn out better than you're expecting. There's a lot of thoughts about money and money matters. Keep them positive. This is what I have for you, Sag. If it resonates, go over to the website, book there. Ask a question or two by texting your question to the number below, receiving the answer to your question all on your mobile device. Also, keep in mind, I am live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night where I answer your questions. I also do a collective reading. And if you're, uh, if you're feeling moved to purchase something for the channel, the Amazon wish list is below. And if you would like to learn the Tarot with me, classes are linked below. 
Thank you, Sagittarius. Uh, Happy birthday and happy holidays. Take care.